Shout out to Noah for sending me this post by Crunchyroll, where they say in the headline, Anime Feminist launches crowdfunding for podcast transcriptions. This will be the third and final upload of the day. Thank you for tuning in. And this is a weird one. Let's just get started and I'll explain why it's weird in a moment. So they say, in 2019, Anime Feminist, a website that features anime commentary, discussions, reviews, and more through a feminist lens, ran a successful Indiegogo crowdfunding campaign to pay for transcriptions of their podcast hosted by the site staff and guests. Now the team is seeking to raise funds again through Patreon and Ko-Fi to continue paying for podcast transcriptions and readers and the rest of the community can do their part to help. So what we have here, let's establish at the beginning, is Anime Feminist, a completely different website that has no affiliation to Crunchyroll really. Um, but Crunchyroll is here promoting it. Why? Because I assume, you know, Anime Feminist, Crunchyroll Agenda, there you go. Does it need to be spelled out any further? I suppose that's why they're talking about this. So Crunchyroll's basically, basically, excuse me, signal boosting that anime feminist needs money. They want people to give them money, and here's Crunchyroll to signal boost it and try to get them some more money. Now, what's really hilarious and gross to me is that these are the same sort of people that will call me a grifter. They call me a grifter. How am I grifting when my content is all free? You get you get the content for free on YouTube. You get the content for free on my own website, by the way, as well, which I can do better on, yeah, and I'm still working on it. But the point is, I made a website paid out of pocket to have the website developed, paid out of pocket to have the uh, the mascot, the logo or whatever. Um, and these people are going to call me a grifter when everything I provide is free. And they're sitting here asking for like $4,000 to get something transcribed. Are you kidding me? First of all, how many people even care about the old podcast episodes? I would love for them to disclose that information. How many views are these old podcasts getting anyways? And why... Why do you think anyone is going to want to read old transcriptions of like 75 old episodes of a podcast? Now, listen, they're running their business. I'm not running their business. Thankfully, uh, I'm really glad I'm not running their business for them. So maybe what I'm getting at is maybe there is a big market for that. And I just don't know. But the reasonable assumption here to me is who the heck is going to want to read these old episodes, especially when they're trying to raise $4,000 for this old content. I mean, that's basically what it seems like. Let's raise $4,000 from our fans and uh, try to get them to pay for these transcriptions, which by the way, I don't think the math really adds up. Let's keep reading though for now. More details from the press release. The 75 episode backlog will cost a total of $4,000 and is planned to be funded primarily through one-time contributions on Ko-Fi. The site staff, meanwhile, hopes to pay the 22, excuse me, 220 it would cost to continue transcribing new episodes through monthly income from Patreon. Seriously, these old episodes, man, I can't get over it. How much money do you think each episode was worth? Each podcast episode, how much money do you think it made them? And do you think it made them over $80 back then? And if it didn't, can you just imagine the poor logic of these people that are like, oh yeah, these podcast episodes didn't make us more than like 20 bucks, but now we're gonna spend $80 transcribing them for people that probably aren't even gonna care. Like, <laughs> it's just so hilarious. Final video of the day, guys. Oh my gosh, Crunchyroll. Are you guys ever gonna stop being amusing, not for your anime, but for like everything else you guys do? <laughs> okay, <laughs> thanks for tuning in, guys. Okay, I'm gonna calm down now. Catch you tomorrow. Peace.